that up, make it into an act. It's the 38th anniversary of the night Johnny proposed to June in the former London Gardens. We'll celebrate that story with the original audience ahead on HBO News. Walk the Line had been out for four months. To promote the DVD, Fox invited Londoners to a free screening. But there was a catch. You had to have been at the concert in 1968 when Johnny proposed to June. What a cool idea. They were singing Jackson, you know, in the Ring of Fire, and, you know, uh, they were singing it together. And he said, will you marry me? June, will you marry me? And it was, you know, I knew right from the beginning, or I felt in my heart that it was true. I think after that, everything went blank. <laughs> but anyway, uh, about halfway through the show, he just turned his, his back kind of to the crowd and he said, will you marry me? And she said in the loudest southern accent that I ever heard in my life was, will I? Like that. She said, will I? What we weren't entirely sure of, i got to be honest, is whether this was a bit of a showbiz shtick. Maybe he does this in every town, right? But I do clearly remember him saying words to the effect, will you marry me? And the words she said were, Johnny, you're embarrassing me in front of all these people. So then there was some flirting and some kibbutzing, and, and I don't know how, I don't recall her clearly saying yes. And then the media reports the next day said, Cash proposes to Carter, and we went, wow, that wasn't a shtick, that was real. It, it was probably staged, I, I would think. I would think. I mean, they really did get married, you know, but I think they wanted to uh, sort of put London on the map a little more by, by doing it here, and you know, Saul Holoff was from here, and that, and so I think that was, I think that was his thinking, you know. You know what? I was delighted a few moments ago uh, to talk to a fellow downstairs. He has pictures. I said, God bless you. It really did happen. I didn't dream this. I didn't imagine this. And there's Johnny Cash. We were sitting in about the eighth row, and uh, the pictures clearly show there he was just before June came out. June Carter had been with Johnny for a couple of years touring. Saul Holoff got them together. And if you want to get into some real trivia, between uh, Saul Holliff and June Carter, they both saved his life. You probably heard that.